Hello Mac here and for today's vlog I will be reviewing a plastic model of Tanjiro Kamado from the anime Kimetsu no Yaiba or Demon Slayer. This plastic model is from Bandai and this is not an entry grade unlike the Doraemon and Detective Conan that I have a speed build on my previous vlog so I will put the link of those vlogs in the description box below in case you want to watch it also the Deku entry grade well, for this plastic model I haven't had the chance to record it since I take my sweet time on building it I think it took me about three to four hours on building this kit well I just take my time in order for it to be almost perfect <laughs> I will base my review on three categories. First is the build on whether it is an easy or hard build. Second is the details of the plastic model and third is for the price. Is it worth it or not? So without further ado, let's start the review. So for the build of this plastic model, it's not that hard unlike the RG and HG Gundam but not that easy of uh, just like an SD Gundam or an entry grade Gundam or something like my Doraemon, Deku, and Detective Conan. The only thing that I want to point out on the build of this kit is the stickers here on his back. The sizes are not symmetrical since it is a kanji. I think it's a kanji writing. So if you are good at painting, you might as well paint it. And if not, well, like me, I don't paint kits. Just be careful on taking it off at the sticker sheet. Maybe you can use a tweezers or hobby knife. It has a lot of stickers. Though the only thing that I think that makes this kit stand out among the entry grade that I have of the, an anime plastic model is his eyes those are not stickers so those eyes are on a separate plastic so I think it's great that Bandai does it like that and not a sticker because we all know that putting stickers on an eye of a plastic model is one hard task <laughs> because there's a possibility that you might mess it up details of this plastic model is great the face is very accurate that birthmark on Tanjiro's forehead is painted and not a sticker also so it's great also let's take off his head for a minute even the teeth and the tongue is showing <laughs> as you can see the hair is nice it has great details and nice coloring his earrings is stickers also but you won't have any problems in attaching i think all of the stickers since it has a guide on the plastic itself his clothes is great too with his signature checkered hauri flowing in the air <laughs> also on the inside his standard demon slayer uniform a dark brown gakuran jacket and a white belt his lower body a baggy pants that has nice details as you can see it has curls on the fabric his tabby socks i think it's what it's called a pair of sorry or his zori or his slippers with red straps and bands of white cloth wrapped tightly around his cubs here so as you can see it has nice curls on the fabric resembling like a real cloth well the nichiren sword is yeah like on the anime color black and it also has stickers like here on the handle 
both of the sides. Well, yeah, <laughs> this kit has a lot of stickers. Well, I think the only advice that I can give you is just don't overthink it when putting those stickers. <laughs> now, the price point of this plastic model is 1,200 pesos or 25 dollars to 1,400 pesos or 27 dollars. Well, it depends on the store. So, it's much expensive than an entry-grade plastic model but more cheaper than the Gundam or Gun Plus of the real grade and master grade. For me, it's worth it because I am a big fan of the anime and manga of the Kimetsu no Yaiba. Well, it's really up to you if you want to feel satisfied on owning a figure of Tanjiro Amado. I think this one's for you since you will be building it. And I think what really lacks about this plastic model is the accessories. Well, there is no interchangeable hands and or interchangeable face. And also the articulation. So what you see now is the only pose that you can get on this plastic model. But still, this is a great addition to your Kimetsu no Yaiba collection nonetheless. Well, that's it for this review of Bandai's Tanjiro Amado from Demon Slayer Anime Plastic Model. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for everyday toys content. And also like my Facebook page. It will be posted on the description box below for you to be updated on my channel. Collect toys and good memories. Thank you 